there, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with a stock swoosh and recapping here from the beginning of October through now. Still a week left in the month, or a couple of days, actually not quite a week, almost a week. And uh, it's really obvious to me anyways that, uh, number one, you can tell it's earnings season. There's a lot of good movers, a lot of stocks having a lot of volatility and a lot of movement. And number two, uh, this really was a big month for having conviction. Certain trades that just uh, took all you got and uh, certain ones you just had to have 100% conviction to go after, maybe even twice, uh, to get the big move in it and really stay with the trades for the rest of them. And anyway, this was so clear. We had a discussion in the trading room earlier this week. This month was all about conviction. Mimi said it in the room and she was 100% right. So October tracking, this is with an advanced risk, 52,365. We got a couple of days left in the month. We'll see how we finish out. But again, it's still earnings season. Even November is earnings season. So this is the time when day traders, particularly day traders, can make money in the market, more so than the, the holiday times or the in-between times. Not that there's not gaps uh, on non-earnings season, but there's just not as many, okay? And they make bigger moves in earnings season too. And that's, that's clear as well. If you'd like more information, you can email me at melissa at thestockswish.com or call me at 929-3200-GAP. You can follow me on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, or Skype. So one of the big winners this month was IBM. Actually, I haven't looked at this recently. It, it fell two days down. The stock collapsed on the earnings, closed the night before around 146-ish, and then opened in the morning around 136. So, you know, it was a big move down and then followed through on the next day. You could have played this for a couple of days. Sometimes when you get a really good gap, highly rated gap, which you'll learn if you take my class in the Golden Gap course, you'll learn the rating system. Some highly rated gaps you can trade as swing trades and overnights or as options trades, or you do them as a quick day trade. But either way, earnings season, what a great picture there. Earnings season is a wonderful time to trade because there are so many stocks of report and this actually is the biggest earnings week this week and next week. Two big weeks. A lot of the tech companies reporting. And you get a lot of movement in the market. Earnings season is the best time to trade. If you want to jump in and get started and learn the system and do it, um, October, November are the good months to be involved and participate in trading. So recapped here the first uh, beginning of the month day off. Then we had S. FIX was a winner. Cenex was a winner. No trades in the fourth. Cost was a big winner in the fifth. Closed for the eighth in the holiday. KR was a small winner. Some trades are big, some are small. Uh, the tenth, Fast was a loser. Qs were a winner. Spy was a loser. And the second trade was a big winner on the 11th. No trades in the 12th. None on the 15th. 16th was the QQQs. IBM took two shots, but really was a good one. There was a good example of the conviction. And then IBM the second day, quick exit on that, but ended up, it ended up falling huge. Just didn't feel the compunction to hold that one. I prefer to focus on the morning, but I mean, that was one that if you held it all day and some people in the room did was another huge day. That was that second day drop actually. And I said, eh. it was just, it was taking too long to go. But the funny thing was that was huge. And then the 19th was a TV day off. The 22nd, Spy was a loser. Apple was a nice winner. Followed through and shot straight up on the 22nd. Went to the target. Went past a little bit. 23rd, M took two shots. Uh, first one, loser. Second one, nice winner. And then T was a fast, quick winner. And actually, that continued too, if you had held out a little bit longer. So October trading results, 52,365. Very strong month. It's been a very strong year. If you're interested in trading for yourself, if you're interested in working from home, if you're interested in learning how to do this, you can email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. I teach a class on my method, on my system, the system that allows me to choose all the stocks we just went over to say this is the one to do today. T is it. We're watching T. Boom. And here's where we're going to get in and out and the stop and the targets and I give the rating. And that's what I do in the trading room every morning so that everybody can check their ratings with my ratings. But the way I know how to choose each of these ticker symbols here, all right? Not one losing day this whole month. The way that I know how to choose these ticker symbols is because I rate the gap. All of those stocks were gapping, okay? So if you'd like to learn my method, the class is November 3rd and 4th. Class tuition through October 31st is $54.99 US dollars. Class price is going up November 1st to $59.99, so it's almost six grand on the first. So if you know you want to do the class in November, you got to sign up. 
uh, and save $500 by October 31st. Class is online. You can be anywhere in the world and take it. If you have any questions, feel free to call me, 929-3200-GAP. It's been a very good month. We'll see how the rest of the month plays out. Have a great day, everyone.